This video is sponsored by PokeTownStore.com, the place for all your Pokemon TCG online needs. They have code cards from a huge variety of sets, so definitely check it out, PokeTownStore.com. Also, if you use the coupon code ZAPDOSTCG, you get 5% of your next order. How cool is that? What's up YouTube, it's Zapdos TCG here and welcome back to our TCG battle video on my channel. Today we're going to be checking out an ADP list with of course the inclusion of Rosa. This is something we haven't checked out on the channel yet and uh, this is an interesting supporter which uh, we can play if uh, one of our Pokemon was knocked out during the opponent's last turn and then we can search our deck for a Pokemon, a trainer card and a basic energy. So uh, typically people would like uh, run like uh, Bill's Analysis or whatever just to get of course the combo pieces. This time around also we are running custom catchers so we can target uh, or go through uh, effects like uh, let's say the Lily's Pokédoll is an annoying matchup. We even have Cryogenol to go uh, up against uh, that kind of a matchup. We have a uh, good Giraffric for uh, the Pidgeotto Control and other stall matchups. And the better thing is here, Absol. Two copies of Absol will make sure that every Jirachi based deck, whether it is uh, Ability Zard or maybe Malamar, will have a hard time because uh, yeah, Jirachi will not be able to retreat with a simple escape board because they will have one retreat cost more. Of course ADP, we know that we're gonna set this guy up and use Altered Creation GX as early as possible. And uh, with the help of Jirachi, uh, we are uh, also uh, a Jirachi based build, so that means if people stamp us, we do have an answer. And uh, Jirachi will help us to find our supporters or maybe uh, combo pieces like uh, Custom Catcher for instance. We have Pokemon Communication, this helps out uh, with a heavy amount of Jirachi, so uh, Jirachis that we don't need. We can use Communication to get wherever we please. We have Keldeo, uh, this is gonna be amazing with the Pure Heart ability. In combination with Kyodex well, that means uh, people will smack down Power Plant and uh, it will get discarded immediately. So that's why uh, Keldeo is still so great. So a lot of uh, yeah, heavy GX based decks will not be able to do anything. We have Drompa here, a one prize attacker, very great in the mirror match and uh, is able to hit to a maximum of 170 damage with the help of the boosted damage output of Altered Creation because I don't know if you've noticed already but Altered Creation will make sure we can take an additional prize card per knockout and all of our Pokemon dish out 30 extra damage. So it's a very, very significant card in the meta right now. We have a tackle engine. That means we have access to Mallow and Lana. Very amazing to heal off 120 damage. Works out very significant uh, or very uh, nicely with uh, Jirachi as well. So you can switch around and uh, then uh, of course you can uh, switch back in with your uh, skateboard Jirachi. We have uh, the uh, Guzman Hala can search out a tool card, a stadium card and of course uh, the special energy. Special energy of choice is rainbow energy. So we can have uh, an answer against everything because uh, the reduction of like a one damage counter is not that uh, significant. You will go to 270 HP, which is not uh, uh, yeah, not it doesn't matter in a lot of matchups. And we have counter game, which is searchable thanks to Guzman Hala. That means we need one Carlos energy less uh, to attack. This can uh, be helpful in the late game if some somebody knocks out your ADP before you can even get an attack off. Uh, except for like Ultra Creation, you can use counter game if you're behind in prize cards. We have. Uh, I think that's the only thing, yeah, skateboards and counter gain are the uh, tool cards. For stadium card, that's Kyodex well, and then uh, for special energy, it's rainbow energy. Since young Link can get back everything and uh, from supporters, and then uh, we have a reset stamp to just slow the opponent down. Six uh, water energies and five metal energy seems to be the trick here for today. So ADP with Rosa, we uh, have tested out a lot of decks on the channel already. If you're interested to see the latest decks in town, be sure to subscribe so you don't ever miss a TCG video. Also, if you uh, have not uh, yeah, liked the video, be sure to do so. That, that definitely helps the video to just uh, get uh, seen by a lot of more people thanks to the YouTube algorithm. But without that out of the way, let's go with ADP Rosa. I myself played a League Cup this weekend and I got 9 out of like 43 players. So I just bubbled out, uh, with the, which is sad. I had 4 wins, 2 losses. And uh, yeah, it just happens sometimes when you bubble out. It uh, doesn't matter too much since I already like... Almost secured my invite, uh, only needing like 28 points, championship points so far, so that's definitely not a hard task for like half of the rest of the season. Okay, what are we up against? The opponent that's nickname is uh, Sleeping Pony, we'll see what how that turns out. We already have communication, so ADP will be alive, and we have a Jirachi, so uh, I think that's uh, not a bad start. We can use Cynthia and Catelyn, and things will go smoothly. Okay, we are facing off against Malamar. We even have Mallow and Lana, so I do think it's a nice way to go about this and go with the Alter Creation Jacks as early as possible. We can go with Item Lock if need be. Let's see here. He has a Jirachi. I don't think he can attack on the first turn, so Absol is not needed right now. The best thing we can get out is our ADP. 
and uh, we'll see. We only have one ADP. There seems to be one priced. Also, uh, Guzman Hala, another Mallow and Lana is in here, so that is definitely not too bad. Okay, we're gonna grab ourselves ADP. We're gonna smack him down. Next up, I'm going to use Cynthia and Catelyn. And uh, we will be, uh, yeah, put a supporter card from the discard pile back. Not that there's one in there. We're gonna get rid of a water energy. And let's draw three cards. Da -da -da -da. Okay, we have Kyle as well, which means no Viridian Force for the opponent. And uh, next up, we're gonna be using the Stellar Wish. Stellar Wish will grab us a reset stamp and a switch. That switch could be uh, necessary for next turn to use Alter Creation GX. We have to be careful because... Uh, I don't know if you've noticed, but a lot of these Malamar lists right now are running the annoying card, uh, yeah, Tina Chomp, which can one-hit KO our uh, yeah, ADP. If he has, of course, the, uh, yeah, I, I, lose, I left my Jirachi in the active position. Maybe I should have switched right now, because right now he can use, like, the uh, Giratina here. Of course, Giratina already in the discard pile with Distortion Door. We'll put one damage counter on our, uh, yeah, Arceus Dalga Falcon, which might make it possible for the opponent to just use that uh, Tina Chomp, or Tina Chomp can smack 240, so he still needs more damage counters on us. We'll see how that goes. Although we have Mellow and Law, so that is also an option for next turn. We'll see. Opponent needs a lot of things. Uh, he cannot uh, use Radiant Force, that means he cannot tin his hand uh, to get energies, as well as uh, yeah, getting a better Lily off. Communication. Oh, Dust North Trevenant. That is something else. What is he gonna do? Is he gonna set this guy up? Okay, he's gonna probably use the GX move, but we do have an answer against it with the form of Mallow and Lana. So he's probably gonna leave us in the active position. The only thing I wanna do here is use the Altered Creation GX. Dust North Trevenant can be kind of a troublesome Pokemon. Is he gonna switch to it? Jirachi. Yeah, he's gonna switch to another Jirachi. Definitely wanna be getting out Absol next turn. He only has one NK so far, so if everything goes as planned, no treasure, no treasure. Okay, communication could be uh, worried some if he gets out another NK. If he's gonna do that, communication. Probably gonna see another NK or a Ditto. Ditto Prism Star is also an option. Oh, he's getting rid of Latios. Latios is also an annoying Pokemon. So we see that Malamar is now increasing the GX count. We see Latios, GX, we see Tina Chop, we see Dust North Trevenant. We'll see how it turns out. This guy can actually get rid of our entire hand, which is uh, very troublesome. Okay, at least we have the option to use Jirachi once more, which is fantastic. So we have Caldeo. Okay, Stellar Wish. Here we go. We get a Cynthia. Cynthia to refresh the hand is actually not bad. Or do we use Tackle and use another Cynthia and Catlin? I think that might be better because we do have so many switching cards we can heal off. Hmm. We, we also have Custom Catcher 1 in the hand. Getting more cards in the hand is probably better. Let's get this tackle. Next up, we are gonna yo, go with one energy over here. We're gonna use the tackle. And uh, what do we need? We can go for Guzman Hala to get ourselves stadium card, an energy gain, or an escape board for our Jirachi. Skateboard for Jirachi would actually be kind of nice. Or a Sintan Catlin to draw some more cards. Definitely want to be getting out my Absol here, so maybe using Sintian Catlin is probably the best plan of action. So we're getting Guzman Hala as well as Sintian Catlin. So this time around we get two cards. We're gonna fill up our hand with a lot of cards, so even if he uses like this uh, Night's Watch, it will not affect us too much. Okay, what do we get rid of? Sintian Catlin, we get rid of... Yeah, put a supporter card. We're gonna get rid of... Huh, this is a hard one. I actually want everything. I think I'm gonna go for Guzman Hala. I don't need, I'll, uh, I think I'll need that for now. We're drawing three cards, so our hand is looking very nice. Even gonna use Tackle, so our hand is like filled up with lots of stuff. Just gonna get out this one card. And now we are gonna go switching out to our uh, ADP. And here comes good old Altered Creation GX. The bad thing is that we didn't get out Absol, which is uh, very troublesome. He can use his GX move here. That could also happen. Setting this guy up nicely, and uh, we did not get not we did not get Absol, but I do think he has. He's gonna use a switch card either way, because there's already one escape board over there. If he doesn't find switch, it's also good. Okay, Stellar Wish. What will he find? No switch card. Come on. 
It is a treasure. Yeah, the leak challenge, or actually uh, it's a leak promo. Treasure looks very nice. Oh, okay, he has a switch, so Absol was irrelevant either way. Although he, now he can use another Stellar Wish. In that instance, he would have gone with uh, the uh, Trevenant Dustnor immediately. We do have Mellow and Lana, so we can easily switch and get rid of the effect here of uh, Pale Moon GX. He's actually gonna use Pale Moon GX to get rid of all of our energies, which is gonna be very nasty. Okay, what to do about this? He's gonna retreat and get rid of all of our energy, so I do think this is the right play with Dust Nor Trevenant. Okay, ooh, what's going on? He's setting up Jirachi? Doesn't he have energies in the discard pile? No! We prevented uh, this from happening thanks to Viridian Forest, so he is uh, one energy short. If he would have gotten out that Dust Nor Trevenant, we would have been in a huge amount of trouble. Oh, wow. That's insane. Okay, we have a switch card, which is fantastic. Uh, so we need to set up our Pokemon here, so we, unfortunately we don't have another ADP. Uh, we can use Melon Lana, we have e even have a Switch card, so I think I'm gonna go for Stellar Wish. We have a Communication, so we can get whatever we please. Communication can get ourselves the Absol. Huh. Counter game is also nice. Yeah, I'm gonna use Communication. We've already used our GX move, so I think getting energies on Caldeo is not bad since uh, he's gonna try and attack with this guy. Although getting a Drampa set up is also not a bad idea. I think I'm gonna go for that. Communication, we're gonna get that Caldeo back in the deck. And we're gonna get ourselves good old Drampa. Ta -da! There we go. We're gonna be using one energy on our ADP and next up we're gonna be switching out still don't have a switch card though but we do have two Mallow and Lana so ultimate ray BAM we get rid of that we get two prize cards for doing that so we get water energy metal energy we do have still one uh, energy to hand so I think yeah attacking with another guy one of those guys probably gonna be using this if I had to guess so Hmm, ADP. we're definitely gonna maybe get an ADP from the list, so I think I'm gonna go with this. Yeah. Energies coming on the Drampa. Ta-da! And we have Custom Catcher, so Drampa can uh, target whatever we please, so we can spam Custom Catchers, and as soon as some of our Pokemon goes down, we can rely on Rosa. So we get two prize cards, we get ADP, of course, we get that. And a Water Energy, so there's still one Metal Energy in the deck, so that means if we can get out another Altered, uh, actually Ultimate Ray, we can set up another one of our uh, Arctis Delga Falcon. but he is probably going to be using the GX move, and we are going to swap to Drampa, which is fantastic. We have two Mellow and Lana. What are, what are the chances of him using Night Watch to get, of course, our two, or both Mellow and Lanas? That would be insane. We still have Skateboard left, though. And we didn't get out Absol, unfortunately. Could have also set up Caldeo, that means uh, we are unaffected by the attacks. Could have been an option. But I do predict a GX move right now. We have a huge hand size, that's 7 in total. And if we can switch, that GX move is going to waste. We already have like Drampa set up. The bad thing is that this card was priced, otherwise we could have like set up another ADP. ADP seems to be very very good right now, definitely against a matchup like this. I am a little bit afraid of the... Uh, Trevenant here, but if he starts attacking with Trevenant, that means if we knock out the Trevenant, we actually win the game. So, we'll see what he does. He's gonna go full force. If he leaves our hand alone, we can simply Mallow and Lana, heal off all the damage. We actually, we're not gonna receive any damage. We can just switch around. Okay, here comes the Torch and Door. Damage on Drampa, damage on Jirachi. Lots of spell attacks around. And it's Cynthia. Cool. Hmm. Also, I want to be checking out a Boswell with a Trevenant list that uses Ms. Magius. I think that's one of those decks that has a, an answer against everything if he can get the full combo off. Okay, he has Great Catcher. Lucky for us, uh, we didn't get Galtio on the bench, otherwise he could have done something crazy. Is he going to use the GX move? Probably. Pale Moon GX. If we stay in the active position, we get knocked out. All of our energies are gone, though. We got a rainbow energy. Okay, that's sweet. Uh, in this instance, it's just fine. We can smack damage with Drampa. 
I guess. And then uh, after this uh, Trevenant list will not run healing cards. The only thing we need to do is knock out this Dustnor and Trevenant and we should be able to win the game. So just gonna go for a switch. Switch the active and uh, we're gonna give a huge amount of damage to this uh, Trevenant here. And uh, he has a great catcher in hand, we know that, but whatever. Let's get an energy over here. In that instance, do we get a water energy? Yeah, let's get this water energy over here. We can also smack down another ADP, but this is uh, gonna be Dragon Arcana. Maybe Caldeo was a little bit better, now that I think about it. BAM! 170 damage. That means we just need to custom catch this Dustnor and Trevenant, and we should be able to win the game. Getting four prize cards thanks to that knockout. And Drompa will only give up one prize card, which is sweet. Next turn, if he knocks us out, we have access to Rosa. So that's fantastic. Rosa can get us a switch card, can get us a basic energy, and also get us a Pokemon. So we can smack down Absol as well. And an item card could be Custom Catcher. So depending on how this turns out, we need to save our ADP at least for one turn. I wonder if he's uh, playing Tina Chomp. That could uh, cause us a little bit of trouble. Malamar is being prepared to just smack some damage. Night's Watch, what does he get? Don't get our Rosa. Don't get our Rosa. Two cards. Ah, he gets our Rosa and our ADP. Okay, our Rosa is gone, so I did not, I was not able to showcase Rosa. Although we still have a Stellarish, we might get it from the Stellarish. Two custom catchers. Ooh, that's crazy. So, let's go with a good old Stellarish. We get Rosa, that's what I told you. We have a stamp, not that it matters too much. I think Rosa is the best plan of action here. So we get a rainbow energy. Actually, we could get a basic energy so we can get that metal energy. So what do I want? I want an Absol. Uh, he is definitely gonna knock us, our Pokemon out. And he can retreat anyway with a switch card. So I think getting another Chirachi is probably better. Chirachi is good. Next up, great. We also have a great catcher, which is awesome. Hmm, hmm. Counter gain could help. Actually, skateboard. And or maybe we stamp him. He has like uh, three, six, seven cards in the hand. Seven cards in the hand. We can already custom catch right now, but that's will not do anything. Could leave him an item lock though. Interesting, interesting scenario. What will we grab? What will we grab? Maybe great catcher, so we uh, ensure. Actually, we need an energy. Okay, that's the metal energy. Ooh, that was close. Okay, we get a skateboard. That's cool. Yeah, we get the metal energy. And now it is interesting. We can leave our. Uh, Jirachi stuck, he's gonna knock it out. So we're definitely gonna be smacking down another one. We're gonna retreat. And the only thing we'll need is like one Rosa. We can custom catch right now, but we can also just find a great catcher, right? Yeah, another custom catcher. Or a Cynthia. Hmm. Cynthia or custom catcher? Let's get a custom catcher. We have three custom catchers in the hand. He's gonna get rid of two, and we have a Jirachi left. Okay, let's see. We have three custom catchers. The only thing we need is an energy. And uh, we should be good. So we just need to custom catch this Dust North Trevenant and that should be game. We get four prize cards for that. He's gonna great catcher our Pokemon. Okay, what is he gonna do with that? Can he get rid of some energies or something? Okay, he gets energies in the discard pile. He can go for Tina Chomp or I don't know what he has. Presumably Latios Prism Star? No, he's gonna switch to Jirachi. Does he have a healing card? I don't think so. Malamar lists do not have room for that. Hmm. Okay, communication. This is a longer battle than I anticipated, so at least we gotta showcase a full game of uh, the new and improved ADP with Rosa. I do love the fact that we can get an energy, a Pokemon, could have also smacked down Absol, that was uh, my second choice, but I wanted if uh, he like knocked out or Jirachi, we have options against that, so... What is he gonna do? He's gonna set up Latios? 
we are just gonna custom catch this guy and knock it out and win the game? Is that gonna be the case? Just gonna go for Tag Purge? Yeah, he's just going for Tag Purge. That means we win the game easy as pie with our insane strategy. So uh, we can even heal off that insane turn. So we can use like Mallow and Lana. So we can get rid of the Rainbow Energy and the Counter Game. So he at least has it to think that we are doing something clever. So we can switch, heal off all the damage that he did, did to us. And then we just Stellar Wish. And uh, we can even Stamp. We have a Cynthia, we have a Rosa. Rosa is so much fun. So even if Jirachis get knocked out, you can simply use Rosa, find your custom catchers, win the game that way. So we're just gonna switch back. And now uh, we are gonna target down this uh, Dustnor and Trevenant and we're gonna say well played and here comes the ultimate ray 180 damage knocking out the Dustnor Trevenant the effect gets uh, included here and we get additional prize card that means four prize cards for this tag team KO that's insane so ADP with Rosa is now the standard definitely check out the list for yourself it is doing very well at tournaments and now look at this four prize cards for simple tag team KO Ta -da! Yeah, if you enjoyed the video, be sure to demolish the like button, subscribe for more content, and uh, don't sleep on ADP. People say it's bad and stuff, but don't listen to them. It's very, very insane. It does well across the entire world and, uh, and every tournament. So definitely check it out. And I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks again for watching, folks. Ciao.